for a mostly pleasant and dry St. Patrick's Day so far. A little sprinkle out there from time to time. Uh, things will change though, and Brian Goddard is here to tell us and help us cope with that change coming up next. Well, we got a break. Uh, we knew the colder air was coming, or cooler air, let's call it that. Uh, that we were not going to be upper 60s to around 70 like it was yesterday, but we still got to 66 in Milwaukee before the clouds rolled in. We had plenty of sunshine this morning. Town of Aaron had a nice weather for their long parade this morning as well. Uh, and then the clouds started rolling in, and now we're seeing some light rain. West Bend, uh, rainy roads, 48 degrees, and the wind is light for right now as it's going to be shifting uh, to the west and northwest here uh, throughout the evening. 48 and raining in Beaver Dam and 46 in Watertown and Waukesha, where it's really not raining too hard yet, is in Milwaukee at 57, 56 in Kenosha. So here are those rain showers. It's light. It's a narrow band. There's some heavier rain now uh, just to the north of Port Washington heading out over the lake. We're not expecting any severe weather, but you notice it's becoming a little bit more widespread down towards Madison, uh, Janesville and Monroe, and that'll be moving in here throughout the evening hours. So Keep an umbrella handy for the rest of the night. And this is a huge storm system sprawling all the way down into Kansas and Oklahoma. There's snow uh, in parts of Kansas, and that storm system is tracking in our direction and will be the reason for nasty weather tomorrow. Rain, wind, fog, oh my. Uh, and then as you get into tomorrow evening and tomorrow night, could see a slushy mix of sleet and snow as well, uh, more to the north of Milwaukee. And then Sunday right now looks to be nice. You'll see those rain chances start to pick up as you get into tomorrow morning and the afternoon. Rain is likely. This will be a cold rain being driven sideways with those gusty winds. Uh, pretty likely as you get into tomorrow afternoon. And as you get later in the afternoon to the evening, it'll start cooling down just a few degrees where you start to see some snow and sleet mixing in. And you can see that the best potential for accumulating snow and sleet is from West Bend to Beaver Dam northward. Meanwhile, cold rain elsewhere during the afternoon tomorrow, even into tomorrow night. That line is very distinct from uh, Sheboygan to West Bend out towards Madison, where you could see about two to four inches of snow. And then finally, late Friday night into Saturday morning, everyone could see a little bit of that sleet and snow uh, that could create a dusting in the rest of the locations. If this was all snow, you're looking at four to seven inches of snow, but it looks like it's going to be about one to two just north of Milwaukee up towards Sheboygan, two to four Fond du Lac and Beaver Dam. But it is going to be very rainy and windy and foggy tomorrow. 39 degrees. 43 on Saturday, hopefully some afternoon sun there. Then Sunday looks very nice at 54 degrees. Next week does not look nice. Cloudy, rainy, and a wintry mix Tuesday night into Wednesday. We'll be right back.